Will we have won the Indominus Rex? I, I bloody hope so. Is it? Is it? Oh! Oh! Heart attack. Thought that was a silver reward there. <laughs> so the silver at the top was like, no! Never mind. So here we go. Finally, we've done it. We won Indominus Rex Gen 2. You finished in the top 1%, but we've already went over that in the last video. The top 1% doesn't make any sense whatsoever. <laughs> Because there's a hundred in the top of a hundred. There's a hundred in the bottom of a hundred. So why? Anyway, here we go. The moment we've been waiting for. Guaranteed books. Oh, sorry. DNA, I should say. Guaranteed books. There you go. Guaranteed food. And finally, Indominus Rex Gen 2. Yes. As well as 2,600 VIP points. Oh, look at level 40, 6,000 health and 2,000 attack, which I think is kind of just on par with a regular Indominus, but we now have it. So not only do we have that, ooh, what else we got? Oh, what's this? Return to the island. Fight in this special event in honor of Jurassic World Falling Kingdom. A little bit, I think Jurassic World Alive was a little bit early then, maybe. Either way, here you go. Lee Zikthes, another one hatched! And that means that we can make a level 20. So we may as well do that first. I'm not getting in books as quickly as I normally do, so we've got to be a little bit careful. So yes, I am coming off the last video, so my voice is a, a little bit worn out, so I do apologize. But we're having fun! Because this is a fun game. And like the other bloody one, <laughs> Jurassic World Alive. God, thank God that's over. Jesus, I'll never put myself through that again. Depression. So here we go. Level 20, 663 health and 253 attack. Ooh, it looks darker. There's like no lighting on it at all. Ooh. I mean, Lee these didn't eat like that, but fair enough. We can't expect scientific accuracy from this game now, can we? Through enormous, oh, though enormous, the Lee these mostly fed on plankton. Well, apparently not this one. <laughs> do you do your research? <laughs> oh, dear. I wonder what, like, could they not have just given it, like, a new animation? So I, I know it takes time and it takes effort and money, which is the main problem. Oh, there you go. Another 20 for doing that. So we are, oh, we're so close to another Indoraptor. Oh, yes. So with that being said, let's have a look. What we got? What we got? Ooh, trade a spino for books. Heck yeah, I'll do it. Uh, anything else that we got? We'll trade you for coin. Huh, no. Other way, maybe. Nope. Nope and nope. So what are we going to do? That's right. We're going to get coin. We're going to do it ourselves. Manually. So there you go. Oh, Ostafrigosaurus, I guess. And then finally. Oh, we can't? Oh, I need more coin. Ah. Can I use this yet? Five minutes. i got to wait five minutes. Or... I can just kind of go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And that's, is that a couple of million there? 44 were we on? Oh, yes, it is. Look at all this coin. 50 million. Yes. Fine, I'll do it myself. God, look at this. Oh, I'm the dirty myself, eh? So there we go. Oh, another Ostrophagosaurus. Fantastic. Great. It's all free of DNA. I mean, what you could do is do the coin for DNA, but um, you're not going to get as much, are you? So we've got 10% discount off in the land creatures. So if there's anything extra that we wanted, 10% is a decent amount. It's not the best. I've seen 20% before. Uh, but we are here mainly. Oh, yeah, I put Zalmoxies in now. We got the Acanthostegas. I think they were put in... Where are they? They were put in somewhere here. Acanthostega. Where was it? It's not this guy. Acanthostega. Uh, I don't know. I was so sure that he was round here. There's Ichthyostega. Is it over here? It's the same size as a... What do you call it? As a carnivore. Huh. Okay, well, let's have a look. We can definitely find it just by going all creatures, amphibians, acanthostega, um, at the bottom, is it? There he is. Already got a level 40, and now we got even more. So, acanthostega isn't a creature that's used too often. 
Um, I will I will just get it to level 20 because it might be used. I might use it. Highly unlikely. And to be fair, I probably didn't even need to bother <laughs> to do this. <laughs> no! All those bugs are turned into Spinosaurus for that. And you ruined it. But one thing we are definitely going to get another one of is Indominus Rex. So I'll feed you up to level 20. 750 health and 455 attack. I mean, the attack's pretty decent. The health's awful. Uh, level 40 it does get like double the health, but not double the attack. He's got a big grin, doesn't he? Um, so let's go on here. So what do we have? Oh, <gasps> we got a VIP. Whoa, what's this is new? VIP exclusive, a, blo a, a, blo a bronze reward and a gold reward. Oh, this is great. This is new. Oh, it's usually just been gold rewards. But now, ah, that makes, so we only have to do three battles for that one. And it's not too tough. Again, another good thing that Luddy have done that's not in Jurassic World Alive. That's in Jurassic World the game. Good God. Okay, so we uh, we need to get that Indoraptor. Oh, sorry, Indominus Rex. So we need to go Carnivore. We need to go down to here. And we need to scroll all the way till we find it. There it is. Ah, precious six days. Ooh, 1,600. Well, here we go. Indominus Rex Gen 2. Already 1,000 health and 369 attack. Right, okay. So where's Indominus Rex? Uh, you are here. Right, okay. What can we do? What can we do? We'll switch. We'll move you so that you're... Ah, where could you go? Ah, I'll tell you what, I, I'd love to s plop it there. Wait, what? I was gonna say I didn't just lose it, did I? <laughs> okay, so we'll we'll put Pyro Pyroraptor away. So I'm pretty sure Tanacalagrius uh, still gets a lot more coin than uh, that guy. So, ooh, two coin from you! <gasps> We've got to put. Oh wait, what? Oops. Ah, oh, no. Okay, hold on. <laughs> I need to move Erlophosaurus over here. Still, we got 100. Is that a million? 1,019,000 from that Indominus Rex. And this Indominus Rex at the moment gets 1,500 coin. But once we put it over here, he gets 4,000. <laughs> wow. Okay, well, let's feed you, shall we? Level 10, 1,769 health and 553 attack. Oh, look at it. That looks so good. And the bam. Oh, I haven't seen that animation in ages. Oh, it looks so cool. So an experiment conducted to better understand the Indominus Rex's predatory instinct resulted in this equally dangerous Gen 2. Well, let's collect. Now, when you get a hybrid, you need to get another hybrid. And at, what, 10% off? Oh, yes! Yes, we are! Hold on, guys. Guys, we could get a level 40 Indominus Rex Gen 2. We could. We could do it. Should we do it? Get level 40? Ooh, we'll have a 2, 4, 6. So that's already 3. Um, oh, no! No! Oh, I didn't mean to click the advert, damn it! Oh, 20 minutes off? Oh, great. <laughs> 20 minutes. What was it? 20 minutes off? What was the time? 20 minutes off 8 hours. Oh, fantastic. Brilliant. Brilliant. Um, so it's going to cost us 16,000 DNA. Sorry, books. Plus, plus the speed ups, which apparently aren't going very well because they're 120 each time. Good lord. So you got a level 20. Oh, yes. Oh, look at you. Oh, you look cool. Okay, let's feed you. 3,030 health and 947 attack. Bam! Oh, I love that throw. It's so cool. That's a level 20. Uh, so we can definitely get... We can definitely make a level 30. Level 20 is the best for uh, the bang for your buck, really. DNA, books, you get the best. Um, but let's see. We get more food. This apex predator's preferred meal is a patasaurus. <gasps> oh, too soon. I mean, it's three years ago, but still too soon. So we can, instead of it costing 29,000, it costs 26,000. So we buy eight of those. We are saving like a good, like 10 to 20,000 DNA-ish. 
So we'll buy these guys. Um, and we do need to sell some stuff as well. So there's another one. Ooh. So how much? 20. How much was it? 20 odd? 26,000. Okay, guys. It's about time. We went through and sold a bunch of stuff. Um, so we need to have a look. Ooh, is Almox is only, only that, eh? Okay. Well, we don't really need the Tarandons, do we? We don't need these guys. 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, 90, and that's a 40, so we don't sell that. I mean, do we really need a level 10, 20, and 30? Do we, I mean, I remember that was my goal, right? I was like, I need level 10, 20, 30, and 40. But do we really need these guys? Do we? I've never, like, it's been years, like, so many years, and I've never, ever once used a level 30 Tropaganathus. And for 360 DNA, you know what? Let's get rid of them. I, I know I'm going against all my morals, but who cares? One level 40. That's all we need. And as long as we get that level 40, we can claim all of this. Oh, yeah. Look, we got some books for that. Fantastic. Uh, so if we do the same with Zing Zing Bujing, so uh, 1,000, 550, 550, 550, 550, 550, 550, 550. Oh, hold on. What? 550. 550. 550. And there you go. Oh, we're getting there. Quetzal. So we're going to sell 11 of these. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There you go. So that's a lot of DNA. Look, we're almost there. Uh, Metro <laughs> Metro I don't think so. Peggy Eyes is... Well, we barely use you. 1,460. I mean, how many do I have? Only, okay, two. So 1,000 and 1,000. There you go. <laughs> hey, all the DNA. So that is another Indominus Rex Gen 2. So we'll quickly buy you and speed you up. Oh, the resources, guys. Look at the resources. Well, you know what? Sorry, it's Indominus Rex. It needs loving. Uh, do not need any of these? Maybe Odomorphodon, but that is... Eudomorphodon is a flipping, what do you call it? A, um, a VIP, so he's going to be really good anyway. So we're definitely going to sell him. Ophicodon. Uh, is there anything else? T-Rex? Whoa, I only have those that many T-Rexes. I have nothing. Oh, okay. Unicorn Wizards! Well, we only need one. I know, I apologize, guys. We're going to have to sell it. <gasps> it's for the greater good. One, two, three, four. There you go. It's going towards a good cause. Uh, Prion Sutures. I, I only have one? Really? Oh, wow. Oh, I've been selling these guys anyway. Oh, sell it. Ostafricosaurus. There you go. Uh, Sukumimus. Oh, level 30. Get rid of it. Don't want it. Give me the DNA. I mean, I guess I'm losing food, but who cares? <laughs> I don't need it. Spinosaurus. One, two, three. Hey, it means that scrolling would be a lot more easy. Okay, so we only have... Oh, no, we do have a level 40 Kool-Aid. So one, two... Three, four, five. There you go. I mean, we're probably going to be losing out on coin, I guess. But we're okay. I don't need to really worry about coin. So we have so many raptors. Um, now, sometimes you do need to have raptors in events, but I think I'm okay. Well, let's sell the level 10. So one, two, three, four. So seven. So one, two, three, four. Five, six, and seven. Oh, no. And an, Oh, no. Is that... Oh, yeah. There you go. Eight. We've still got another one. Oh, still got another one. <laughs> I forgot. It's 12, isn't it? So we can definitely buy another one. Allosaurus. Eh, sell those guys. One, two, three, four, five. There you go. That's a thousand DNA right there. Irritators. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, and another one. Eight. What else we got? Uh, I really should do this off camera. I do apologize. You Raptor, we need to get rid of 70. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Beautiful. Right, so we can buy one more. So already we have one, two, three, four, five, six, including this one. So we need two more. Two more Indominus Rexes. So we need 40 odd thousand DNA. Um. I'm just trying to think. If we've got any of the dinosaurs that we can definitely sell from. La oh, we got two of them or four. Okay, so 10 of these. So that's 700 DNA from this. Oh my god. So many stegosaurs. Oh, get rid of them. Yes. 
Oh, that was satisfying. Oh, that was satisfying. <laughs> That's so many of them. Good lord. Oh my god, I got- Whoa! I have so many Ankyloticuses! Oh, that's crazy. Could I say- Oh, they're 5,000 each. I mean, I have six of them. Should we sell them? I think- You know what? I, I never use them. We may as well, right? Like, one, two, three, four. And that's it. We only need to sell four. And that's us done. I'll keep those other guys. Forgot about all those hybrids. <gasps> Forgot about these guys down here, too. Oh, those are, like, really good ones anyway. So... Let's go over here and get more and, well, two more. I'm pretty sure. Oh, we need a little bit more. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. We're going to have to sell one here. Boop, up you go. Is that enough? I think that's enough. So six and the final one done. We had 20 odd thousand bucks and now we have 40. <laughs> so we're going to feed all of these Indominus Rexes. Oh, wow. I haven't done this for ages, ages and ages, like maxing up a creature. Okay, 140 plus 120. Oh, done first time. Oh, oh, again. You can do that again, please. So that's another, that's a level 20. So let's fuse another level 10. Come on. Ah, oh, damn, damn. I think we're going to get to just above 10,000 bucks, I think. I think. I could be wrong, though. I think maybe, maybe 12 is... 12,000 bucks. Say 1,700 to spend just for speed ups. But it depends on how long it takes to like max up that level 40. Like the 40 evolution. So that's you. And then one more. Come on, first time. Damn it. Why? Why? I don't even know why I'm bothering. I'm spending so many books and so much DNA on a creature that I don't really need. I mean, eventually, right? It's going to get into Raptor Gen 2. I would have thought if we, it'll be like, imagine that, Indominus Rex Gen 2 with Indoraptor. Oh my god, that would be so powerful. Oh, oh yeah, okay, we've done it. Okay, we just need to make these level 20s. And yeah, that's it. Okay, so we've only got 750 DNA left. Woo! Which means that uh, it's 160 for that, 162. Oh no! And we're going to get some books back and some DNA back. For once, we oh, there you go. Woo! Woo! A level 30. Woo! 3,000 attack. Sorry, health and 1,000 attack. So there you go. There's. Oh, wait. No, that's level 20. That's a level 30. Look at the coloring. So what did we get? We got another 100 bucks. Oh, that's good. Nomus X Gen 2 is able to communicate with the Gen 2 creatures it was hybridized with. Uh, as in, like, Velociraptor and T Rex? Okay. I guess, I guess, yeah, sure, whatever. Oh god, we're gonna have to sell more stuff. We're gonna have to sell more. Oh no! Yep, that's it. We need to sell. We need to sell more. I think that other Ankylodocus is gonna have to go. I'm so sorry. Whoop! 5,000 DNA, just like that. Already hybridizing this, so here we go. See results. Unfortunately, nothing. We've only got to get this one and then one more fuse. Oh, that's it. <gasps> this is it. Here we go. That's two level 30s. Done and done. Feed you. I didn't even check my food. It's costing like millions to feed this guy. This is it. The last fusion to get a level 40 Indominus Rex. So come on. Here we go. Evolve. <gasps> there it is. 180 DNA and 288 bucks. Oh, and it wasn't done first time. Oh, no. Come on. Come on, man. Come on. Yes! Yes! Okay, it was just under 12,000. But we are going to get some back anyway. So 5,504 health and 1,720 without any food. Oh, God, it's 2 million! Are we going to be able to afford this? No, we can't! <laughs> oh, my God! We can't afford a maximum of 20 million to get it to level 40. Are you kidding me? Wow. Okay, so we need... How much? We are so close. Do we get food from this? Oh, we do. Oh, there it is. Oh, that's good. The cuttlefish DNA added to this hybrid makes it a master of camouflage. So here we go. The final one. Level 40, 6,536 health and 2,042 attack. Oh, yes. A level 40 Indominus Rex. And look at his red eyes. So happy. 
Look at them both there. Ooh. So I don't have a level 40 Indominus Rex uh, either. Huh. Interesting. Well, should we sell this one? Kind of tempted to sell. I mean, it is, it is fed though. How much does it sell for? 14,000. Hmm. It would have been good to see what a level 40 Indominus Rex was like against a level 40 uh, Indominus Rex Gen 2. Maybe if we go to the market, we go to hybrids. And as long as I... Do I not have... I don't have it. Okay, this is good. We can scroll. Here we go. So, they're exactly the same amount. What? They're exactly the same amount, except for Indominus Rex Gen 2 has... 100 extra, or sorry, 1,000 extra health, but Indominus Rex has, oh my god, that's so not worth it. Indominus Rex has 32 extra attack in comparison to our Indominus Rex Gen 2's 1,106 extra health. And the same price. Huh. Would you know? Well, there you have it. We've got an Indominus Rex Gen 2 maxed up was it worth it? Not really. We also have this event. We, <laughs> we have an earth shouting, but return to the island. Yeah, let's do this one. Wait, what? That's got nothing to do with Fruit of Fallen Kingdom. What? What does this pack give you? What's the, what's the, there's nothing to do with Fallen Kingdom. What does a Megalodon have to do with Fallen? You kidding me? All right, fair enough. Whatever's, I suppose. Uh, is there anything else we can do? We could do the Clash of the Titans and get Megalosaurus. Guys, let's bring Indogen 2 into... Oh my god, he's all the way over there! Fantastic, yes. Well, tell you what, let's not bring him right away. Have we got another Indominus Rex? Where's... Oh, there's level 30. Ah, uh, damn. Now, this is going from the... Uh, what do you call it? The uh, tournament that I just completed to do it. So that's why a lot of these creatures are used up. Uh, I could have just went for carnivores, I suppose. Oh god, loads of them are used. Jesus! Okay, that'll do. I think that's above and beyond the Call of Duty. I don't think we need anything more than that. Was it a waste of resources? Yes, probably. More than likely. But I can say I've got an Indogen 2 level 40. So I'm just going to go for loads of reserves. Because who cares? Come on then. You can't win, Sticky. Oh, that's a... Fallen Kingdom has recent... It recently came on Netflix. And it also... It came on TV. Uh, it was on ITV or something like that. I think there was two versions. There was one that had so much censored out of it. It was ridiculous that I watched. And after watching Fallen Kingdom... There, I don't know where it was, but there was reference after reference to Jurassic Park. I think it was, um, it was, oh, the bit where they're hiding from Indoraptor behind the T-Rex, oh, sorry, Triceratops skull. And it was like shot after shot. It was like, that's a reference to Jurassic Park. That's a reference to Jurassic Park. Because they turn on the power. That's like the electric fence scene. They hide from Indoraptor. That's like when they hide from the actual raptors in the kitchen. And there was something else. It was just like, oh my God, just, it was... Uh, is it deliberate? Are you deliberately doing scene for scene remake of Jurassic Park? Like, uh, well, not scene for scene remake, obviously, but it just was like reference after reference. I don't know if J.A.B. Owner meant to do that, but it definitely felt that way. Um, and it, I was kind of tempted to like make a video on it. Um, but I don't want to be copyright struck by universe. Oh, a full on attack. How much damage can Indora Indominus Rex Gen 2 do? 61,000 damage. Yeah, he won or she won. It won, whatever. Uh, oh, here we go. Ooh, okay, little bit tougher. Gonna need some amphibians. Um, don't have any though. Okay, so we're gonna have to do this tactic. We're gonna have to do this one. And then we're gonna go for Gorgosuchus. It's like a tournament battle. So Gorgosuchus, I think, should be able to kill it in one hit. I think it has like 2,000 attack. Um, and then he'll... His co Tani Calagrius. Tani or Tani Calagrius. Ca Cali what, oh, I can't remember his name. <laughs> Tani... Tani Calagrius? Calagrius, is it? Yeah, Tani Calagrius. I think that's right. I got it right. And then he switches out anyway to get a Mastodonosaurus. Uh, don't know why. 
but uh, we'll kill it. So that's it dead. Factor in two block just in case. Uh, there you go. Well, I factored in two block, two, two block for us, but we really didn't need to do that. So I got 500. I could have went for two reserve, but it doesn't matter anyway, because he's dead. Ooh, bam. Gorgosuch is doing a wonderful job. So that's two out of five battles. Third battle coming up. Um, again, same thing. Let's just do this and then put an Indoraptor level 20. Bam. Now, do you really need a level 40 Indoraptor? No. No, it's awful. Now, if this was Jurassic World Alive, everybody would be using Indoraptor level 40. And I would have to use it. But I don't. Because this isn't PvP paid for paid to win game. Bull rubbish. <laughs> so, how much attack does that have? Oh, you can't kill me in two hits. Although, it's, it's got a lot of attack. Whoa, 900 extra than Tani Colagrius. He can do about like 5,000. Oh, he's going to do it as well. Oh, fine. Right. I kill you in one hit. And then I'm just going to go for three block. Because there's not. I don't think I can take a hit from Concavenator. Level 40. Almost. Level 39. Oh, I could. Yeah, never mind. I could have been clever and went for two block, one reserve. Making sure that he was definitely killed in the next go. So, he had three attack, right? So, I can just go for four. Yeah. Yum. Three out of five battles done. We almost got Megalosaurus unlocked. Really, I don't need to unlock Megalosaurus, but we are going to be able to get a crud ton of DNA. Uh, it's DNA, may well, maybe books, but definitely a lot of VIP points. So we need another amphibian. Uh, we'll put you first. We don't have any, though. I could put you, Don, in. Yeah, let's put you, Don, in. And something that's like, oh god, scroll quicker, you. Ah! Look at the little dot at the bottom. It's taking, it's taking so long to go across. Ostapasaurus level 10. There you go. Udon should be able to kill Metapasaurus in two hits because. reasons. As long as it's got more than 1,600 attack. Oh, yep. There you go. I think that should kill in two hits. One, two. Yep, and there it is. And one reserve because we've got 11,000 health. And I'm pretty sure Concavenator... Oh, yeah. We faced up against the level 39 before anyway. And he didn't stand a chance. <gasps> Not a chance. Two hits. Yeah, cheeky, get you. Scaly versus Feathered. I win. Actually, yeah, there you go. I think one hit could probably kill the Proceratosaurus as well. It's got a lot of attack. Yeah, a lot of attack, but not much health. It's a glass cannon. And oh, it goes for it, though. Woo! Less than half health. How could you? It's a mighty you done. Feathers win out. Sorry, brother. You have to die. Ah, there can only be one feathered king. So there you go. And the final one is... It's an Indoraptor's dream. Indoraptor delight. So, I mean, I can... Actually, I can't kill... I have to go for two hits for that Apatosaurus. He's got so much health. Uh, and then... Yeah, I guess. It doesn't... I think Indoraptor's got this. I have to go for two attack, one reserve. A Lumbia will come in. Not be able to kill me. We'll switch out. Um, and then the Metaposaurus, I think it is, will probably... May go for one attack? But even then, I'm just going to switch into Dina Cheris. So, oh, tell you what, though. He almost killed it one hit. It was close. Wabam! Two hits would have killed two of them. Right. I can kill Elumbia in one hit. That's all I need to worry about. I can definitely kill him in one hit. Oh, my God! Okay. Uh, so, we've definitely won. One. One, two. Uh... And that's it. There you go. Because he'll only have three. And he can only do one attack. That's only 2,000. Uh, it's not guaranteed. Oh, no, it is. Because I'm going to have five. And he's only got three three blocks. So I would have killed him in two anyway. But he went for one attack. So with two, yeah, two would have killed him. Yeah. That was so easy. <laughs> that was super easy. My God. He's like, ah! Megalosaurus! Oh, 5,000 DNA. I could have used that before. I could have saved one of me uh, Ankylodocuses and Megalosaurus done, as well as what we need. 2,600 VIP points. Unlock Megalosaurus, but we don't need that. But it's another Megalosaurus we've got. Oh, it's another one I need to hatch then. Good lord. Okay, so we need herbivores. 
And we need good ones. Like, really good ones. Uh, Apatosaurus? Yeah, I guess. Right. Can we do it? This is the first time that VIP has been different and giving us different rewards. So, uh, let's give this a shot. I think this is... I think... The Gallimimus hybrid, or whatever it is, has more attack than Antarctic Pelter. It doesn't have more health, but I think it has more attack. Let's have a check. Yeah, he does. Okay, so we'll just get as many reserves as possible and make them use as many goes as possible as well. And then a Padasaur can just tank the rest of it. Oh, this is great. I don't think we can kill him in two hits, though. Oh, we can. Oh, perfect. I'll go for one. I'll factor in two just in case. Oh, there you go. Whoop out. Rip crack with his rapid tail. Oh, the beast was done. Oh, brings in Skeletor. Oh, God. He can kill me in three. No, he went for four. No. He's dead. You killed him. But you're about to die, too. <laughs> don't even know why I went for an extra one. He didn't have anything. It's because I don't care. I'm too good at the game. Something I can't say for Jurassic World Alive. I'm terrible, apparently. Oh, no, four. He's killed him. Oh, it's a close one. But is it? 1,000. Oh, we're going to have to do the earthquake. How much damage can you do max? 22,000. It's not that much. Even with the type advantage, 22,000 isn't great. And you're level 40. And a VIP. God, you're all about health. And that's terrible, because you're a herbivore. And herbivores are against carnivores, and carnivores usually have loads of attack. Okay, here we go. Here's a more... Here's a mixed bag. Right. Mm. So, Segnosuchus is the... Was, yeah, he's got... We're gonna have to use Segnosuchus here. Yeah, there you go. Done. Done and done. Little Todgies. Little Todgy sandwich. Or, or sure, uh, <laughs> if I can speak. Sego, se, Segnosuchus? Is it Segnosuchus? Segnosuchus sandwich. Yeah. Segnosuchus. Because <laughs> Tijongosaurus is the bread bun. So, we're gonna have to go for two attack, actually, here. whoop -am. And halving your attack to only a pitiful 900. And then Superosaurus. Ooh, I don't know. 1,700. Please go for the attack. Oh, fantastic. Thank you very much, sir. So we'll go for two attack on you. Um, and I can safely say that two hits from the Columbia won't kill me. Because I'll only do 2,000 damage. Or a little over. And we can definitely kill him in one. And there you go. And only one battle left. Takes me below half health. Again, how dare you? Against Segnosuchus. Woo! Yum! Look at that. 44,000 that was. And that was only a couple of hits. Oh, the DNA, please. I need it. I'm so poor. Oh, a flyer! Oh, uh, oh hold on, though. We'll use one Tijongasaurus, a Metrophodon, and then... Uh, it looks like a carnivores. What do I have? Uh, nothing great. Eh. Like, uh, yeah, that's not great. Mm. Okay, let's use Erlophosaurus. It's overkill, but we may as well. Yeah, there you go. So straight in, one reserve, making them deliberately have to attack us. We'll go for one attack, two reserves with Metrophodon. He'll switch out to Shinosaurus. Shinosaurus won't be able to kill Metrophodon in one hit. Because it has 5,000 attack. It's, it's pretty it's pretty much order play at this point. Whee! So yeah, I do apologize uh, if it has seemed to only be... Uh, what do you call it? Um, Jurassic World the game videos recently. <laughs> I did play Cry uh, Crinosaur Collision Course. I love that game. It's so much fun. Um, so we'll switch into Elophosaurus. Uh, but the Isle is about to update. So there's no... I mean, I guess I could do one final video for old time's sake. Because once that goes, I don't think you can play it again. I'm not sure whether there'll be two versions able to be played or not. Um, okay, yeah, if we get one hit, we've killed them. We may as well try it. And it's a two-hit wonder. Bam! So we get bronze rewards. And that's pretty good. Uh, no, it's actually terrible. Never mind, that was awful. <laughs> oh my god. A blimp. A blimp and coin. Pitiful. Rubbish. But what do we get? Oh, yes, there it is. We have another Indoraptor. 2005. And we may as well 
plunk it in. Um, boop. Six. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Balls. <laughs> but we have another interrupter bringing our total. Where is interrupter? Where are you? There you are. 20, 20. So that's two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Technically nine. So we could have a level 40 and a level 10 if we so wished. Or we could sell an interrupter for 40,000. How much does a level 20 sell for? Well, I guess that makes sense. <laughs> it's double the price. Well, guys, there you have it. We're going to wrap this little video up here. Short and sweet. Well, I say short. It is like 30 minutes. But if you enjoyed it, leave a like. And until next time, maybe I'll see you in the aisle. Ooh, in a new updated aisle. I'll see you later. Oh, bye-bye.